I have been part of the LGBT community for 25 years, and I've had the privilege of being placed in several facilities throughout the state of California, so I know what I'm doing. Now, while it may not seem fair, I am ending all extra activities offered here. Theater, writing, group. It all ends, effective immediately. If you'd like to discuss it further, my door is always open. Benji is my assistant, he's my right hand. What Benji says is what I say. Now one of you must be Slice. Yes, I'm, I'm Slice. According to uh, records at the facility, you are very well liked and respected. Uh, people like me. <laughs> Well, you can be Benji's assistant. So, now to get to me, you can go to Slice. Slice goes to Benji, and Benji comes to me. I always reported to Jay. Well, now you can report to Slice. Like I said, there might be some hurt feelings, but it's all for the best. This place is neither a mental hospital nor a bathhouse. We're going to run this place my way, and my way will succeed. I promise. Oh, and there are no negotiations, so if you don't like it, this is the door and here's how it works. Hey, Jennifer. I like extra mayonnaise on my blow me sandwich. Okay, is anybody going to say anything? Josh? Well, it's nice working with you all. You're not going to leave us. We wouldn't leave you. I'm in the middle of rehearsals. I have 12 actors and an internet star. I need to explain that the production is off. You are not the only person getting screwed here. My groups are finished. Lesbians are cruel. Guys, you can still do the play, just don't do it there. And use our own money? I barely get by as it is now, though. Amen. My groups are over. Theater company is over. LGBT rights at the LGBT center are over. Jesus, can you all stop bitching? You're ruining my high. Just sing something. <laughs> We don't want to see ships have a gone off the sea. Should have been at that meeting. Yeah, probably. Slice gave Ben an ecstasy pill. You serious? <laughs> yeah, he took it. Shit. Good for Ben. Crazy group of people, man. Huh? Yeah, that's the best part about it. They're my kind of people. Crazy feels normal to me. Like, what society treats as normal, getting married, having a kid work, that. That feels crazy to me. Do you know want to get married? I haven't thought about it before. Probably not. I do. I do? Yeah. Yeah, I just gotta find the right person, you know. <laughs> Ever been in love? Yeah. You? Once. I have a long story. But I was acquitted. You funny. Sick sense of humor. What else is there? How do you feel right now? What do you mean? Use the strongest word to describe how you feel. Right now. I feel. 
love. <laughs> Me too. Underneath the bottle or on the radio, have you lost all your patience with every little thing, or are you just found out? Hello. You only made a hundred bucks? What the? No, because that is bad for business. So the next time you do what the man tells you. I, I don't care. I, I gotta go. Bye. Tommy, right? Yeah. Listen, I, I just, I wanna talk to you just for a second about group. Um, you know, it, it's, it's beneficial to all mm -hmm. of us, yeah. and it's, it's working. I understand you started the group. Yeah. Mm. But see, you're not a therapist, and we could get sued. Well, it, it's, it, it's peer <clears throat> counseling. A, a lot of LGBTQ teens, they come to me for help. 90% of these people, they don't have anywhere to go, no one to trust. I, I'm, I'm just hoping that you'll reconsider this. Was Zach Miller in your group? No. No, he was not part of the group, and that keeps coming up. And I can only assume that's why Jay got fired. But Zach, he joined Jay's writing class because he had a crush, and it wasn't mutual. And what happened, it wasn't even about any of that. It was about mental illness, all right? So rather than ignoring that, why don't we work our asses off and try to educate the community about it? See, Jay was promoted to San Diego. He wasn't fired. Though I do think it's interesting that he would be sleeping with young men from this center. But the more I look around, the more I see what a terrible job he did. So you want me to just tell everyone no more group, never again? Yes. You know how hard that's gonna be for some people? Yes. Do you care? <laughs> Tommy, I will always be here for you and anyone else for these wonderful little arguments that I will always win. Now, is there anything else? It's Valentine's Day. Is there anything you'd like me to pick up for your husband? Frank and I don't do Valentine's. Oh, it's a shame. My boyfriend got me some really nice flowers inside. Would you like to see them? Yeah, well, that's great. You should go enjoy them before they die. What the fuck are you doing here? I need your help, Shannon. I'm in a lot of trouble. What do you need now, Mother? I need to break the silence. <laughs> it was perfect. We have to get up. <laughs> we did say some things. We did. <laughs> <laughs> Love. 
Any questioning that happened? No. We both said we loved each other yesterday. And it's just wondering if it was in the heat of the moment for you. I don't say stupid things because I'm stupid. I say them because I'm in love. You're in love. Mm, deal with it. So then. We're boyfriends then? Mm. Uh. <laughs> yes, we are. Mm. Now we can get to know each other better. The first thing is I'm a morning person mm -mm. and we have to get up. Okay. Mm, we have to get up. Oh, yep, we're getting up. It's strike one. I'm not a morning person. Well, I hope you join me in here. Hello? Nathan Cross, how are you? Devin? No, I... Last I heard he was going to Jairus' aunt's house in Phoenix. Why? Hello? Nate? 